The knowledge capture counterfeit management solution can be broken down into three main processes. This video will take you through all three processes and how we've created an end-to-end -end platform to capture, process and analyse all counterfeit related cases as they come through a business. The first step in this process is the identification phase. This can be done a number of different ways, either across the digital web from sites such as eBay, Amazon and Alibaba, or it could be based on a physical investigation where an agent in the field has an actual product in front of them and they're looking to identify whether or not this product is counterfeited or not. A major problem for organisations is understanding what's being sold via online retailing sites such as eBay and Amazon. Currently, these platforms provide an open place for sellers all across the world to sell potentially counterfeited goods. It's critical for organisations to understand when these goods are being sold and what products are being counterfeited online the most. For example, if we take this product here, we can see we've got one star reviews. So let's take a deeper look to see what's in that. When we open up the review page, we're able to see that a customer has complained, potentially saying that the package was already open when it arrived. It didn't quite smell like the genuine product. And after using it for a few days, they've also identified that a rash has occurred. This could mean that certain chemicals or products that are not present in the actual product are present in the counterfeited product. Where the knowledge capture platform comes into its own is we're able to take information that's posted on these sites in review format and bring them into our solution where we can start to run comprehensive natural language processing and text analytics to understand what's being said in an automated fashion. We've taken this same review and brought it into our platform and using our content analytic capabilities, we've understood the three key parts of this message and highlighted them ready for visual analysis. This part of the knowledge capture solution can also integrate with social media sites, bringing further insights and further valuable information into a central platform for an investigator to utilize. The next step of the KC counterfeit identification phase is utilizing a mobile application for physical investigation. This is incredibly useful for organizations that have agents in the field or have to respond to alerts of counterfeit cases and need the ability for their agents to be able to identify counterfeit related goods whilst in the field. The knowledge capture anti-counterfeiting mobile application provides agents with the ability to understand when goods are counterfeited and can utilize and get hold of that information they need whilst in the field. This particular mobile application features the ability to scan a barcode or batch number of a particular product and that will then do a lookup to find the content related to that particular product that they have. By clicking on the scan button, this will bring up the camera using the smartphone. We're able to take a look at the product itself and when we come to the barcode, it does a scan and an automatic lookup to find any documentation relating to that particular product. By clicking on the view option, I can see this information and see this content. We can use pinch and zoom functions as you would most mobile applications. So we can zoom in and start to understand a bit more about the actual product itself. So most counterfeited goods, the colors or metallics of the actual product itself might be flat. It might not shine like it should on a genuine product. There could be nuances within the barcode that an agent needs to look out for that an everyday member of the public probably wouldn't pick up on. Or it could be a case of there's slight differences in the actual packaging itself. So it could be certain words are slightly skewed or misspelt, or it could even be the product doesn't quite feel right. So the, the actual materials being used are slightly cheaper. This mobile application is great for helping agents in the field to understand when content is potentially counterfeited. This resource provides them with all the documentation and data they need in order to make a strong assessment on what's actually in front of them. The next step in the knowledge capture counterfeit management process is the processing phase. And this uses the knowledge capture case management system in order to provide a platform for agents 
to process these counterfeit cases through a structured business process. The Knowledge Capture Case Manager System for Counterfeit is a central archive for all business documentation relating to that particular case. So say for example, an alert has been generated from an online retailer or an agent in the field has picked up a counterfeited product, they can send all of that information into this central system. In the top left hand corner, we get automatically generated case numbers. They can be assigned to certain work queues, category types, and can be defined by region and state. As we go through this, we can also assign it different brand managers and also different external sources as to where this information has come from. We can also include the details of the product we found as well. So in this case, we can break this down and say that it's part of the household bathroom range and it's personal care. We can then start to assign values to these products and in order to understand the costs associated to these counterfeited goods to the organisation. As a case proceeds, you can also look to enter suspect information and this will then stay with the case into resolution. This means that you can start to track if certain suspects are more common and keep popping up amongst a number of different cases. And as this case potentially comes to a resolution, you can also look to understand the proceedings and results. This is where we can start to understand if any manufacturers or retailers were taken down during this process. Or if certain individuals were provided a fine or a prison sentence. It can all be captured and stored within this central platform. In the middle, we also can capture a wide variety of electronic documents, ranging from images through to PDFs, voice and video files, in order for you to build an entire case around this particular counterfeited product. We can even look to combine both the physical and electronic sources of information into a central case as well, if there are links that we've identified during this investigation. So all of the content from the online portals from Ebay's, Amazon's, can all be brought into this central system. As you would expect with a case management system, cases can be defined by SLAs, alerts can be automatically generated to managers if certain deadlines are missed, and every single action that takes place within this case manager system goes into a secure audit trail. This enables the organisation to understand exactly who is doing what to certain cases and how long it takes for them to actually process a case as well. The final phase of this counterfeit process is to be able to report and analyse the data that you've captured and processed so far. The KC Anti-Counterfeit Solution makes use of the KC QI reporting module, which provides real-time drillable dashboards on all of the data currently being processed within the case management system. Businesses can use this data to look back across historical data We'll also get a snapshot of what is happening within that system at this very moment in time. The data being held within the case management system is presented graphically by a number of different charts. These charts feature a number of core different ways in which you can actually view this data to make it actionable intelligence inside the business. In this view, we're currently looking at the seizures by category, where we can start to understand and see that the personal categorization is quite clearly having the most amount of counterfeited goods. It could be there is a break in that chain that we now need to fix. We can also start to report values associated to these particular categorizations as well. So at the bottom, based on the numbers that have been inputted into the case management system are all reflected on this particular screen. By clicking on any of the line items, we're able to drill into that particular categorization and see the data that's just affecting that particular chart. If we now take this selection and look at it geographically, we can start to see where the hotspots are as to where the most amount of counterfeited goods are being picked up from. By clearing this selection, we can also see on a global picture just where these counterfeit cases are currently being processed and where they're currently being managed. In this particular chart, the darker the blue is where the most amount of costs associated to counterfeit cases are occurring. It may be we need to take a business decision to deploy more local resource in order to understand why counterfeit is so rife in certain countries and certain places. We can also take this data and display it across various different dashboards. So all of the ways that we've shown how you can capture and identify counterfeit products all feed through via the case system into this dashboard reporting capability.
This concludes the end-to-end -end demonstration of the Knowledge Capture Anti-Counterfeit Management Solution. We've covered off the identification phase using tools to capture data from websites and also using mobile applications to capture physical products. I've also shown you the case management capabilities where we're able to process all of this business data that comes through that's related to counterfeited goods. And finally, the reporting capabilities as well to offer real business value and business insights into the data being captured and processed. I hope this overview has been helpful for yourself. And if you have any questions, please do not hesitate to contact us at sales at Thank you very much for your time.